I've been speaking to a, a lot of these farmers who have chosen uh, to come up here in Paris uh, with their tractors, tractors uh, that are still blocking cars uh, on the ring road here in Paris. They set off early morning from all the motorways uh, coming into the French capital and uh, their message is basically threefold. They're saying three things. They're saying first that uh, there are too many rules and regulations uh, that are imposed by the government, that that is hurting their competitivity on the international market. Second, they're saying uh, that the government is negotiating trade deals uh, between, for example, the European Union and the Mercosur in Latin America. They say that the conditions in which uh, products are produced over there uh, are very different from the norms uh, that are required here. They say that's unfair competition. And then, last but not least, and this is very important to all these people who are uh, behind me, they say uh, that they are being unfairly treated uh, by the general public, by media. They're saying that the government is not doing enough uh, to stop, for example, uh, the anti-meat NGOs that are now attacking farms uh, across France. Uh, they say they are being mistreated and this, of course, is having uh, dramatic uh, repercussions on the farmers here in France with uh, many suicides uh, in this uh, specific job sector. So, uh, Many, many demands and uh, one big demand, which is uh, to be uh, to meet Emmanuel Macron, the president himself, and to speak to him directly.